One of Austin's most congested highways gets two new projects to help you with all that bumper to bumper gridlock. This morning, the state is breaking ground on the I-35 construction projects. More than one. Kate is live near 51st Street with your details on this one. Good morning. Good morning, Telly. Yeah, we're along the I-35 in northbound frontage road, but just behind me off in the distance, you can see the 51st Street Bridge, and that is where they're going to be putting in a roundabout. In fact, this is going to be the first roundabout on any of our state highway frontage roads. Crews will also create an interstate bypass lane for drivers who complain that getting to Airport Boulevard just took too much time. The price tag, $16.5 million. Now, here's a look at what the roundabout will eventually look like. You can see it takes away the traffic lights that often cause cars to back up. Texas says a combined 400,000 cars travel on these two stretches of I-35 here in Old Torf every day. And new traffic patterns will also cut down on the number of dangerous accidents on this highway. Anybody who's traveling on I-35 knows some of the traffic challenges that we're dealing with. And by not having to wait at a traffic signal, not only are you reducing delay, but you're also getting those people out of the intersection, which makes it safer. And coming up in 30 minutes, we're going to tell you a little bit more about what's going to be happening down south of here along Old Torf. Here's the thing, though. These projects, while exciting, it's going to take about three years for TechStop to complete them. This all comes at a time when I-35 was named the second most congested highway here in Texas. For now, we're live in Austin, KY.KXA News.